So what is it that you're afraid of, Puto? What makes you that? What, what what makes you think I'm afraid, Doc? Your behavior yesterday tells tells me that you don't want to leave this place. Is no. It, is it that you are afraid of getting out of this place, Puto? No, Doc. I am ready to leave this place. I am ready. Wait, Doc. What are you typing there now? What do you think I'm typing, Puto? Maybe you are trying to say I'm a bad person or something. Are you accepting that you have done a mistake? I'm a changed man, okay? I'm a changed man, Doc. You are a house divided, too. Now let's go back to how it all happened. <laughs> Mr. Matlare, will you be using English or Sotswana? English, my lady. Okay. I have a sick leave here with me from the state attorney. He won't be able to attend, but we can proceed. Please tell the court your name. I am Tuso Matlare. Mr. Matlare, I see that you have made an application for reduction of your sentence of five years. That was granted in 2018 before his worship Tuto. I read the count as follows. One count of harassment, a second count of intimidation, a third count of unlawful detainment, and a fourth count of stalking. Tell me why I should review your sentence. I am remorseful, my lady, and I have learned my lesson. And I've been on rehabilitation, and the doctor at prison said I have been diagnosed with obsessive disorder. That's why I, 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 I believe I need help, and I'm a changed man from my past ways. Okay. Mr. Matara, how long have you been in prison? One year. Is it true that the, the judge had served you with five, sentenced you with five years? That's true, my lady. Mm. Okay, this is my order. Based on the submission that Mr. Matare had indicated that he has served one year sentence and would like to be released because he is remorseful, he has dependence, and might have a medical condition, I give the following order. That the magistrate's sentence of five years in prison is hereby set aside as it was excessive and replaced with the following. The accused is released from prison with immediate effect. A restraining order is hereby granted and the accused is ordered to stay more than 500 meters away from the complainant. That the accused is ordered to attend at a hospital and see a psychiatrist. The accused is to offer four hours of community service per week at the woman's shelter. And finally, that you'll be played, placed on probation. You should not commit a similar offense within two years of this date. Do you understand this, Mr. Matare? Yes, my lady. Do you understand the seriousness of this, of this offense? Yes, my lady. Okay. You're released. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Stella, where are you? My mind is all over the place. Um, I was called to go for questioning this morning at the police station with regards to Johnson's case. So ever since my mind has been all over the place. Oh, I'm so sorry, friend. Yeah. I know he meant so much to you. Yes, he was such a nice guy. But does he have any family? Um, not that I know of. He didn't talk about his family much, but I know of his brother, Michael. But they didn't keep in touch much because Johnson didn't approve of his way of life. Um, he hung around thugs. But maybe I should try to find him, maybe on Facebook or something, to tell him, yeah. I'm so sorry, friend, but I'm here for you if you ever need anything. <laughs> Sure, bro. Yeah, yeah that's this the guy who knows how to get the tiro away, bro. I'm sure we can arrange that. Okay. Document is on his own phone. Again, yeah. Yeah, again, yeah, bro. Again, we're going to trace it, bro. I don't know how much I'll get, bro. Look at these CCT cameras. There's a there's a CBD there, bro. Because I'm going to go to that guy was made to go to CBD. So you put my brother to sleep. You have to die. You will sleep soon. Why are you doing this to me? 